What's up, guys? Welcome to the show. Thank you for watching. So, women seek simps just so they can eat free daily. And that's so true. But, and you know, that's why the pool of, what's the word I'm looking for? Qualified or, let's say, good men are dwindling is because after a certain age, men wake up. You don't have to be living on the streets to learn that lesson and what's worth it in life and what's not. And the only reason why women are acting the way they do, because still enough simps out there to deal with and push over and take the money from them. Because the first thing a gold digger is going to do, yeah, she's going to hug you, but she's going for your wallet. She might not take it the first time. She's sizing it up. She, she's thinking, you're thinking she's feeling you up. She's thinking, where does he keep his wallet? On his back? On his front? And trust me, like ingrained in her head, she'll never forget where that wallet is. Always be careful if a woman says, hey, hon, I'll wash your clothes for you. Don't ever do that. You wash your own clothes. You watch your wallet. Because you give too much power and you give too much trust. I've heard some horror stories. In fact, I'll give you a quick one. I knew a guy way back in the 80s. He dated this girl. He had all his furniture, everything in his place. He let her live with her. He let her live with him, sorry. He didn't see it coming, he said. I said, there had to be signs, but he said no. He came home one day, the place was empty. She moved everything out, she stole everything from him, and left. If that isn't a crushing life blow, I don't know what is. And if that isn't the best lesson for staying single, single I don't know what is. I don't want any guy to go through that crap. Learn the red flags early because there had to be red flags or sleep with one eye open or better yet, you move a girl into your place, you're a fool if you don't have hidden cameras pull up, put up. I'm just saying, it's a great idea. It's a, if it's your house, you're only protected. This girl is not married to you. I'm just saying, guys, you have a guy come in beforehand and you put in three or four cameras and it alerts you when something goes wrong. Trust me, there'll be nothing more satisfying than that phone thing going off and you see what's going on, you call 911. You don't even have to go home. You probably would want to. You want to get there just to see her in handcuffs. Anyways... Just some advice from the old guy.